Hey guys, so today we're going to work on taking our third person template and changing the character skin. So this is a very common question is how do I make it so I'm not just the default skin? <clears throat> so we make our third person package and then we're going to close this out, come back to the Epic Scheme Launcher. And we're going to use some free libraries or assets to help us out. So uh, we're going to use the Paragon Sparrow asset, which is free from the Unreal Engine Marketplace. I'll put a link in the description. After you go to the Marketplace and uh, take care of this, it'll add it to your library. Once it's in your library, you can hit Add to Project. We're going to add that to the project we just created. That'll take a moment to do. The first time that you do it, it'll take much longer, uh, but I've used this before. So now we're going to go back to our project and open it up. All right, cool. So if we come back to our content, we can see we have the third person uh, template. And then we also have this folder with Paragon Sparrow, uh, characters, and then you can come in and uh, see the sparrow character and there's there's a lot of different tools for this in here uh, but we're gonna uh, quickly in the easy way take our third person character okay and go back to the viewport and hit mesh on the left so then on this side we can see the skeletal mesh so we're gonna take the sparrow skeletal mesh and apply it to this and it'll take a few minutes for it to compile the shaders, but we see now we have the Sparrow character here. And um, we have the textures being compiled, so you'll start to see colors come across the character as, um, as the shaders are compiled. Okay, and then for the animation blueprint, we want to tie this um, to... The blueprint that's going to um, show the animations of the character. Now, in this situation, you um, probably want to use the Sparrow Anim blueprint because the animations created in it are specifically tied to this character, um, whether it's shooting the bow or those sorts of things. Um, however, if you wanted to make it easier, you could use the um, let's see here the third person anim blueprint and this would follow everything exactly as the third person template um, however there's some difficulties because uh, her bow is on the ground and that sort of thing and uh, it just might not flow as well and it, it would take a lot more work um, so we're going to use the sparrow anim blueprint um, and let's see here, it looks like our shaders are compiled. So we're gonna compile and save this. And then we're gonna go ahead and play. And we can see our Sparrow character has come into the world. The way the animations start is uh, when you start, uh, she picks up her bow and goes into the shooting position. And then you can go and run around. And you notice how as we jump or as we land, uh, the legs bend and everything is good. Uh, now there's no crouching shooting that sort of thing that's a whole nother video uh, although those animations are included and easy to use when you get into that part but this is at least a quick way to change your uh, basic character into someone else um, there's also other packages out there that include characters without weapons and that may be more what you want until um, until you start adding uh, things like shooting and that sort of stuff. So anyways, that's all. Like and subscribe and happy coding.